John Hunter and Heather McClenahan describe Stanislaw Ulam's background and his role in developing the hydrogen bomb. The Ulam family lived at Spruce Cottage on Bathtub Row, and um, they were immigrant scientists um, and, and his family uh, who had fled uh, the war in Europe. And after the war, when the United States then realized that the Soviet Union had detonated their own atomic weapon in 1949. The laboratory was given the task to come up with a, a more powerful bomb, which then became the hydrogen bomb, or known as the super back then. And Stanislaw Ulam was the scientist who had the key insight in how to trigger that bomb. And supposedly, he was standing at Spruce Cottage on a winter afternoon, looking out at the, the garden that, of course, was, was now gone because of the winter. And it's supposedly looking through the window at Spruce Cottage that he had the idea of how to trigger a thermonuclear device. He was the mathematician who figured out all of the calculations to make the hydrogen bomb work. Edward Teller is known as the father of the hydrogen bomb, but here in Los Alamos we call him the midwife because he was the one who made sure that the, the bomb was born, but it was Stan Ulam who was really the one who created those calculations to make it happen.